In this comprehensive tutorial, I will guide you through the process of removing background noise and keyboard sounds in OBS, Open Broadcaster Software. The first step is to ensure that you have selected the correct microphone in the OBS settings. To do this, navigate to the Controls menu and click on Settings. In the Audio section, choose your desired microphone from the Global Audio Devices drop down menu. Once selected, Click on Apply and then OK to save the changes. Once the microphone is set, it's essential to consider the proximity of the microphone itself. Moving the microphone closer to you can help minimize unwanted ambient noise and improve the overall audio quality. The next step involves adjusting the audio settings for the microphone. It's crucial to strike a balance between the microphone volume and avoiding distortion. Sometimes, maxing out the microphone volume can lead to distorted audio. It's recommended to lower the volume level to a reasonable level that allows for clear and crisp sound without any distortion issues. Now, let's delve into adding filters to your microphone in OBS. Begin by clicking on the microphone source within OBS, look for the More button, usually represented by three dots, and click on it. From the drop-down menu, select Filters. This will open the filters window, where you can add and customize different audio filters. The first filter to add is noise suppression. Click on the plus button to add a new filter and select noise suppression from the available options. You can optionally name the filter for easy reference. This filter is designed to reduce and eliminate background noise, resulting in cleaner audio. Next, let's add the noise gate filter. Click on the plus button again to add a new filter and select noise gate from the options. Similar to the previous filter, you can name it if you prefer. The noise gate filter allows you to set certain thresholds for when the microphone should open and close based on the audio level. Within the noise gate filter settings, there are several parameters to adjust. The closed threshold determines the audio level below which the microphone will be muted. By lowering this threshold, you can minimize background noise during silent moments. On the other hand, the open threshold sets the audio level above which the microphone will be heard. This helps eliminate low-level background noise. Additionally, you can customize the attack time, which determines how quickly the microphone opens when sound is detected. The hold time determines the duration for which the microphone remains open after detecting sound. Adjusting these two settings can help fine-tune the behavior of the microphone in response to different audio conditions. Lastly, the release time controls how quickly the microphone closes after you finish speaking, ensuring a smooth fade-out of sound. By adjusting these filters and settings based on your specific needs and audio environment, you can effectively remove background noise and keyboard sounds, resulting in improved audio quality for your OBS recordings or live streams. Remember to experiment with the settings to find the optimal balance that suits your requirements. If you found this tutorial helpful, please consider liking the video and subscribing to the channel for more informative content.